For this quick tip, you will learn of the new functionality being added to the product design extension in the 2022 May release. With this May release, we have improved the functionality of two features in the product design extension. The first is the addition of visibility controls to the SnapFit command. These controls were first introduced in the BOSS command, so many may already be familiar with them. Here you can see, if we add some snap fits to this case, we can now control the transparency of both the top and bottom component. We also have the ability to have a section analysis appear. This allows the user to have better visibility into the cross section of the snap fit. In addition to visibility controls and snap fits, we also have the ability to add ribs to bosses in the boss command. When we first released our product design extension, we asked our users what else they wanted to add, and overwhelmingly they said they wanted to add ribs to their bosses. So that's what we delivered. Now when you create a boss, you can see we have a new tab for adding ribs. Simply check the box on which side of the boss you want a rib, and the dialog is automatically populated based on your material selection. You can also see a preview of what the ribs will look like to detect if there will be any interferences with other parts in the assembly. Here you can see that there will be two interferences we need to consider. First, we can rotate the ribs to ensure that the ones on the top left don't interfere with the PCB elements. Second, we can reduce the size of the ribs on the bottom to ensure that the ribs have a gap between them and the PCB board. These are just a few of the ways you can modify the ribs in this dialog. Once you have tweaked them to your liking, simply click OK and the boss with ribs will be created for you. Now you know about the new functionality that was introduced in the May 2020 release in the product design extension. If you would like to keep up to date with all the new functionality being released in Fusion 360, please like and subscribe to our channel.